I'm Joe Zicky, inventor of the Revolution, and let's push the extreme performance of the Revolution kite only using level 2 Club 38 skills. Here's the basic skills. Here are the basic skills we're going to focus on today. The launch and stop. And the side hover. Rule number one, lock down your side hover. Side hovers both sides, to the left and to the right. The side hover is key in unstable and light conditions because it generates the most lift. In a regular hover, the lift is always perpendicular to your sail. So in a regular hover, the lift is almost all straight back. In a side hover, you pull that wing towards you and almost all the lift goes up. For precision flying, you need to be able to instantly move to that side hover and hold it. The best way to do that is jump off the ground, go into that side hover, and feel that position, then come back down. Then do it to the other side, feel that position. Then when you switch from side hover to side hover, you should already have a feel for that position that you're shooting for. Number two, gradually increase the difficulty of the challenge. For example, pick a spot on the ground, fly over and stop and practice that steady hover. All right, now let's pick a real object to fly up to and hover next to. The palm tree is great. One thing you gotta keep in mind with trees, for example, is they can be a little rough. So if you happen to bump your lines into them, they could get caught. Now maybe touch the object with your lines. This is mainly a challenge for you to stay calm. Rule number three, stay calm, don't panic. A fast reaction is usually an overreaction. Oh no, a right hover, not a left hover. If something unexpected happens, usually the best thing to do is to stop, hover, and reverse the flight path. Uh oh, wind's dying. Just ease it back, ease it back, ease it back. There we go. If something unexpected happens, the next best thing to do maybe is nothing at all. If you jump in and you're a little bit out of control and you try to pull it out, lots of times that just makes the situation worse. Oh, 
stuck a little bit. Alright, just let it go, just let it go, just let it go. Alright, let's take a walk through the park. Alright, so let's launch it, turn it into a side hover, and start walking through the trees. Remember, we can generate more lift by pulling back or dropping it down to keep it below the branches. Let's see what happens. We launch, turn into a side hover, walk slowly. three miles an hour under the branches let's try a tree wrap oops lost the wind right behind the tree back it up there we go there's wrapped around better wind over on that side of it you see it's wrapped about halfway around the tree Okay, let's reverse it back out. So I'm, I was walking with the wind, so it was actually getting lighter as I was walking in. So it might help to be walking back. I should be walking into the wind. And here we go. Side hover. The wind's still pretty light. It's about two. Back it up into the tree. I'm searching for some wind. I don't feel much wind. Wind it over here. So pick up a rev, join us at Club 38 and master your rev skills. Visit us at revkites.com and we'll see you on the field.